A nice man told me the other day on the street that uh, my rear right light wouldn't work. And uh, I wasn't sure what that could be because uh, I haven't done really anything to the lights or to the electric. I was hoping it's just a bulb. So let's see. Turn the light on, please. Well, I guess indeed it does not work. That's the rear light. Open it up. And you can see here is where the cables come from the, the, the rear electrical box. It's all quite logic. Nothing fancy, nothing too complicated. Here's the plus. Brown is negative. So it's the gray and white cable. This light is also not working, so likely it's not the bulb. Here it's not the bulb for sure, you can see. It's likely the fuse. Quite obviously, the fuse is blown here. The next fuse that I put in blew right away again as well. So I think we have a larger problem here. There's a secret power box down here. I'm not quite sure what's in it, but we will find out. It's the fuse box underneath the truck. There's some nice schematic. This here is this here is for the real lights. And as you can see, out of each of these contacts, there are three wires coming out. One is for the upper light, one is for the main light, and one is for the hitch plug. You can see here, it clearly says that this is the real light on the right hand side. I unplugged it already. And lo and behold, the fuse doesn't blow anymore. This is where the power wires go into the, the pipe in here. And here in the corner is where they go into the, the light of the cabin. And here is where I was trying to weld. So I suspect that inside I can melt the cable as well. I didn't think about that. On suspicion that we have a short here in the top pipe where I welded, welded. I cut the positive wire that goes into the pipe and indeed the fuse doesn't blow any longer. So I screwed up, I guess. I'm not quite sure I'm gonna fix this. It's a little bit of a pain in the ass. I hope I can get to it from the outside, feed a cable through and then connect it to this one here, then it should work again. Let's see through the camera. It's a little difficult with a time delay. I think I'm gonna get through. Let's see on the inside. there, but it's winding up into the insulation. Here we go. Okay, now it's just a matter of putting those two pieces together. And then we have power again on this night. Sucks, but it will. I forgot that I still have to connect this side of the cable. I'll do that now. Ta-da! The light works again. Thank goodness, wasn't too difficult. Pain in the butt.